Do you want to implement a video call effect like WhatsApp on the web? Maybe you want to use call to enhance any type of user experience in scenarios such as social and community, telehealth, sales and consultation, and online education. Today I will show you how to build your own React project on the web in less than 10 minutes. Open the trtc.io page, click Developers and Call, then click Integration on the left column, select WebNH5, React. This is the integration document for CallKit. Follow this document, you can build a React project that can make calls, similar to WhatsApp, from 0 to 1. Before we start, let's check that the environment is correct. First, make sure your React version is Dons 18.0. Second, make sure your Node.js version is Dons 18.0 and has Morden Browser. Step 1. Activate the service. To create an application, we need to obtain SDK App ID, SDK Secret Key, which will be used in Step 4. Let's click Step 4 to see. Here we need to fill in two parameters, SDK App ID and User SIG will be passed in during Initialize. Now go back to Step 1 and click Activate the Service. You can have a 7-day free trial for each SDK App ID. Click Tencent RTC Console. Click Create Application. Enter an application name such as CallKit. Click Create. Now the application has been created. Let's return to the page. This is the CallKit application we just created. If you click it, you can see SDK App ID and SDK Secret Key. Step 2. Create a React project. First, we need to install Create React App. Copy the code. If your permissions are incorrect, you may need to add sudo before the code. Enter password. Now we can create a new React project. Copy this line of code and paste it. During the installing, the downloaded CallKit demo appears on the desktop. Wait a minute. Now the project is created. Let's go to the project directory. Copy this line of code and paste. Now we are in the directory of the CallKit demo project. Step 3. Download the 2i CallKit. Download the npm package o10centcloud.dar call uikit react. At the same time, open our developer tools. I use VS Code. Open the CallKit demo project we just downloaded and drag it into VS Code. Let's go back to the documentation. Copy the debug directory to your project directory callkit demo asrc. It is necessary when generating user sig locally. User sig will be used in the subsequent login process. Copy this line of code and paste. You can see that there is a debug directory under the src. Now go back to the documentation. Step 4. Initialize the TWI call kit. In the src by app.tsx directory, copy the TWI call kit component code here. Here you can see this is the TWI call kit component. Click app.tsx. I will replace the return function here. Paste the code you just copied. Next, we need to log in to the component. Copy the code to import the call UIKit related API object. Replace the code here. Then copy the rest of the code. Paste here. We need to replace SDK App ID, SDK Secret Key here, which we obtained in the first step. Now let's return to the console. Fill in SDK App ID, SDK Secret Key as two parameters. Step 5. 
Make your first call. We need to use the 2iCallKitServer.call API to make a call. Copy the code and paste. Now the code has been implemented, let's review it. Here we need to initialize the 2iCallKit component. The first parameter user ID is a random custom user ID, and you can enter any string. The second parameter user sig is generated here. SDK app ID is obtained from the console. After init is finished, we can make the first video call. Now let's run the project. We should enter npm run dev. Click package.json and see what our startup command is. My command is start. Click here to open the terminal. Type npm run start or npm run dev. You can see that the web page has been opened. Let's go back to the document. Open two browser pages, enter different custom user ID, click step 1, in it to log in. After the user ID of both pages in it to successfully, click on step 2. Call to make a call. The expected effect is as follows. OK, let's open two browser pages and go back to the first page. Enter user ID such as Tate to log in. Click Step 1. After successful initialization, this window will pop up. On the second page, enter another user ID such as Natural. Now we go back to the first page and start making a call. Please make sure the user ID of call already exists in it. Now we have successfully implemented the call function. You can click Accept. Camera on. Mute. Full screen. And hang up. For more features, you can learn about AI denoising, virtual background, UI customization, on-cloud recording, configuring nicknames and avatars, configure resolution and fill mode, group call, floating window, custom ringtone. There is also some API documentation here for your reference. Here are also answers to some frequently asked questions. Search for TRTC.io, create powerful engagements with real-time communication.